When I was a child, I was often daydreaming of traveling the world. I was swimming with the fish in the wide ocean and playing with all kinds of animals, discovering different cultures, lands and nationalities, just to figure out there aren't any nationalities at all. I had these dreams of flying through the world, but at some point you have to wake up. I'm born into a system which makes consumption, work and desire to the highest values, while on the other hand humanity, trust and love gets left behind. No one at school teaches you how to care for each other. I lost in my routines, I also lost my dreams. I walk up in reality, but what is reality? Is reality fulfilling expectations and going wild from party to party? This can't be the sense of life. So under the pressure, the call for freedom grew stronger and stronger. And then, after meeting the person of my life, my fire was burning again. Opening a gate to infinite creativity, pleasure and inspiration. This channel is meant to inspire you on your personal way. Reality is a choice. You can choose which way you want to go. We will try to show you some doors. But you need to go by yourself. But go, don't hesitate to risk something, don't hesitate to do something for the first time. Go out into the nature, into the forest, love all animals, love every single human being. Love our beautiful world and love yourself. Try not to be mean or jealous, always stand up when someone pushes you, always fight for your rights. You are worth it, you are beautiful. We are one human family. Never forget this. Go and ask yourself, what is my biggest dream in my life? What do I want to reach in my life? And then stand up. Why are you still waiting? Who is forcing you to be a person that you don't want to be? We are the creators of our own universe. Never lose your dreams. Don't let them control your thoughts and think through your heart. Be kind, respectful and polite. There is no planet B that is free also. This is us and that's how we live. We are two free spirits enjoying life and abundance. Every day is a present as we walk grateful and guided through this life carried by our belief and connected to our spirits. No rush, no hurry, no dates, not planning at all. Waking up with the sun and falling asleep under the moon and the stars. Our home is where our heart is, here on this beautiful planet. At the moment we are living in our extremely cool van. His name is Sunny and together we are driving further into the south. The last years we learned to live from our creativity, handmade jewelry, basking in the streets and fire shows. We are performers. We love the people, but also tranquility and peace. Every day is a new adventure. We are living our dream and we are creating our own paradise, day by day. But this is not how it starts. Oh no, man. After our last journey, we went back to our homeland, Germany to see our families, friends, enjoying some festivals. It's always exciting to come back for a visit. But this time we had some trouble. Our beautiful car wasn't allowed to drive anymore and the repair was really expensive. After some time we decided to find a nice place for our car and search for something bigger to live inside. 
After a lot of research we found Sunny, or better said his brother. In the beginning everything was great, the cries, feelings, the connection with the car. But then the guy who sold us the car went crazy, making false promises, lying at us, spending all of our money and letting us wait while we had to organize everything. In a nutshell, after nine weeks waiting and fighting, we finally got our new home. Now the next step was turning our van into a home. So we went to some stores to buy everything we needed. The first thing we did was the floor. We had to clean everything, cut the pieces and place them on the right place. And finished. The floor looks great. After we finished the floor, we left Berlin to drive to a friend. He has a garage and nice tools so we could work properly on our van. <laughs> After removing all shelves and brackets, we could start with the bed. Yes. <laughs> All right. Let's see if it fits. <laughs> To finish the bed was a lot of work, way more than we expected, but it was like that with probably every step. Altogether we made it. Last step. <laughs> okay, und los. Ooh, 
nice. Looks super comfy already. After finishing the bed, I started with the kitchen. Nice, look at this beautiful new kitchen. <laughs> On the last morning in Germany the sun came out. For now the van looks really great. It's not finished completely. But the weather and the vibes in Germany got so cold that we had to go. We will finish the rest step by step on our journey. We met our friends and families for the last time and said goodbye to everyone. And then we finally started our journey into the south. After a couple of days of driving, we arrived at a very, very special spot. High up in the mountains where the eagles fly and the cold summer breeze is dancing in the leaves, there is a place so beautiful and so pure. Almost not affected by human pollution, nature has grown wild. Just some hippies and a few locals. Here, in the middle of the forest, nature gives us the probably most amazing present. Natural hot springs. Wow!
guys, thank you so much for watching the first episode of our YouTube channel Conscious Revolution. It was great fun creating a video like this and I'm excited to take you with us on our journey. If you would like to see how this journey goes on and how we take a big ferry to drive over the Atlantic Ocean, stay tuned for the next episode. Leave a like, smash that subscribe button. And if you like our way of living and you like to support our dreams and projects, there's a link in the video description. Thank you so much and Namaste.